Saudi or fever, 100 degrees Fahrenheit, keep it hot. What's up, y'all? So, my bad for uh, not posting the last couple of days. I lost my GoPro. When I lost it, but misplaced it, and I was looking crazy for it. But I finally found it when I stopped looking for it. Crazy. But yeah, um, you know, I, I didn't get no, no much footage on, uh, you know, the journey, but, you know, we back, baby. So, um, but today, since I really didn't have much footage besides from what you just saw that's pretty much just me uh when i was in florida right now i'm in uh south carolina just five miles off the north carolina border and uh yeah so i'm just gonna go ahead and get straight to it let's go ahead and make a beat all right let's get straight to it all right so remember i said i'm gonna try to do things a little different with this one so there is this app right here plugin uh it's called seeds or lemonade seeds uh, seeds by lemonade uh, it's a super super dope uh, if you got beat stars or use beat starts to upload your beats uh, They pretty much come included with it. So uh, so yeah, so we're gonna go ahead and go to melody chords Let's actually go C sharp minor Get seed let's see what comes up with that one right there so we're gonna go ahead and use that one let's go ahead and uh start this up go ahead and drag it to the DAW put in the MIDI track and I'm going to find my favorite plugin analog lab for Arturia let's find some keys on here there's this this analog has some real nice clean keys <laughs> Keep looking around for some other sounds and then send so i'm a um c sharp minor it seems like it's like the melody but i'm gonna go ahead and click here on chords find some chords that uh fit the vibe okay that don't sound too bad let's go ahead and try that one Let's find some paths for that. Okay, that sounds pretty good. So we're gonna ride with that, just find a different sound. Ooh, oh yeah, I like that right there. Yeah, all right, that sounds perfect. Sounds real perfect, I love it so far. So I'm going to go ahead and start building some drums from here. Uh, get the vibe. We got the vibe. So let's keep going with the vibe. Okay. Okay. Let's dig that. I, I, I dig that for sure. That sounds good. I'm loving it so far, how it's sounding. Find a clap. Trying to layer that clap real quick. Let me see how it sounds. find a kick right now but i'm gonna go ahead and do the 808 first we got the vibe on point so all right 
just wanted to get some notes in there. I like that simple and hits. And in my 808s, I like to uh, put a drum bus. If you don't know what a drum bus is, it's pretty much just put some bass on that. All right, let's put some saturation, bring that high end up a little bit. And that second one, I'm gonna do a little. All right, so another thing that I would do with this lemonade, this is why I like it so much because it gives me so much variety within that MIDI notes that what I do is I grab one of these. Uh, it could be it could be even both. And then I grab a certain part of the uh, of the MIDI and I put a different sound to it. So kind of fills it up with sounds a little bit. Uh, I'm going to show you exactly what I'm talking about. Where is Let's see, go that, Let's see what kind of sound we can find here. Uh, duplicate that down here. Okay, I'm gonna take these notes down here. All the lower notes. But you see what I mean when you add that extra sound on top of it. Just take out certain notes. Yeah, I pitched it up. Fills it up very nice. Uh, I think, uh, let me see. Let's see if I pitched it down. That's it. I mean, personally, I think that sounds like a complete beat once it's fully arranged. Go ahead and arrange it real quick. Finish up this beat. Now, that might be everything for this beat, uh, truly. Uh, let's see how this will sound. If you have not tried Deja Vu by Cymatic, I will recommend. I mean, this plugin is amazing. Let's put 100%. That's with it, and I'm going to show you without it. All right, another thing I'm going to do, I'm going to grab these chords, and I'm actually going to use the base of the uh, chords and do a little bass line for some drops. So, like, when it's, like, kind of, like, low like that, like this part right here. Bring in a little uh, bass synth uh, going on there. I'm not feeling that bass so much. Let's find something else. I don't think that'll work. Just got to find a nice simple bass on it. Okay, I like that. Let's, let's see how it sounds. You know what? Maybe I got to get rid of more of the low end on this uh, pad. See if that'll help it fit in a little. Let's go ahead and drop that tag. Got to put that tag on there. Got to keep it hot, baby. Sorry, your fever, 100 degrees Fahrenheit. Keep it hot.
And I still have, actually, I haven't even done a kick on it yet. Once I put that kick on it, it's gonna knock real hard. Put a little compressor on this to make the low, um, the low parts of that song or that melody more like uh, work a little harder. And I'm just gonna go ahead and grab these right here. Just go ahead and drop that down here. All right, like that's honestly, personally, that's complete. Maybe a little better mix now, but that's that's done. I'm gonna save that and let's play from the beginning so you can hear what we got. Actually, let me take that off of there. Yeah, let's take that off. Let it all drop together. Sorry, your fever, hundred degrees Fahrenheit, keep it hot. That pretty much wraps up that beat there. So uh, go ahead and uh, feel free to like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know what you think of this beat. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and uh, fully finish it out. Uh, probably put another hook on it. Maybe filter it out. You know what I mean? Get a little, get a little freaky with it. <laughs> and, uh, and yeah, thanks again for watching. Stay tuned for the next one.